entry number three in the intermediate division. Wait, did I leave the oven on? It's been tough on all of the paladins since Lotor came around. But it's been particularly difficult on Alora. Matt can see it and is adamant to make her feel better, but he can't help his wandering mind. It's not as easy to make someone feel better as one expects. something wrong? No, no, I just have a lot in my mind right now. Do you want to talk about it? Oh, it's just all this stuff with Shiro and Lotor and the Coalition and essentially- God, she's pretty. It's really I wonder how old she is. She was stuck inside the stasis pod for 10,000 years. Does she age? Her father is really old. Man, I'm hungry. I wonder if Hunk is done making me all tame pizza rolls. Wait, hadn't he told me to watch the oven? Did I leave the oven on? Oh, Quiznack. Oh, wait, she's talking. What's she saying? I'm in the mice of the ball out of my hair, so no one part of my hair is shorter than the other, and I cannot, I don't know what to do about this situation. No, oh, it's nothing important. Speaking of hair, though, I wonder if that's her natural color. Her dad's hair was white. I think her mom's was, too. Maybe that's a recessive gene in Altans, but then why is Coran's hair orange? Did he dye his hair orange? Do they have space hair dye? Would I look good with white hair? Would I look like my dad? I don't think I want to look old. Oh, wait, wait, she's talking. Thank you, Matt. I really need to get this off of my chest. Of course, princess. Anytime and anything for you. Yes, well, I think I will discuss this with Prince Loto. It is important and does require his attention. We'll be working closest with this. Not a problem! Entry number three, performed by Chrome Heart Studio. I keep trying to hand him my mic. He has his own mic. Are you going to tell us that story you really want to tell us? Do you guys want to hear the story? Are you sure? stopped his pirating and mended his ways, but his parrot was just too bad, constantly swearing and refusing to behave. Finally, the ex-pirate had enough of it. When the pirate started swearing again, he stuck it in the freezer for five minutes. And when he fished it out again, the bird was very humble and said, I promise I'll be good now, John, no swearing. Just a question, what on earth did the turkey do? Yeah. It was, it was a long drive from Baltimore. 